Hi Pisces, welcome to my channel Scorpio Cat Tarot. This reading is going to be for the week of March 29th through April 5th. Hope all the Pisces out there are doing well. Let's see what we got going on this week. Page of Pentacles, okay? So could be a message. Uh, stability, security. It could be a financial message. Um, something to do with your finances. Could be some money coming your way. Ten of Cups, meow, Pisces. So that's like ultimate wish fulfillment. That's, you know... Um, husband and a wife standing under a friggin' rainbow of cups, children, house, you know. Um, I don't know if that's coming towards you, if that's what you're wanting. Let's dig deeper, shall we? Queen of Pentacles. You could be in a little bit of a self-protection mode. Um... Queen of Pentacles is kind of, she's sort of reserved, you know, she doesn't um, act impetuously or rashly. She's very secure, stable. Um, she's not overly emotional. She's not um, crazy passionate. She's very grounded and stable. I think that's your energy right now. You're kind of Queen of Pentacles, just solid. You're in a very solid position place right now in your life nine of cups okay so he's happy fulfilled you know all his cups are there he's chilling so I feel oh, okay nine of pentacles look at that right after the nine of cups I feel like you're not wanting for anything right now you're in a good place in your life okay um, just kind of doing you Live in your life. Um, I don't feel like you're struggling or, you know, wanting or needing anything, per se. Not really looking for anything to happen. And there's the King of Pentacles. Okay, so now we got the salt and pepper shakers on the board. We got a matching set. So, you could have a partnership coming towards you. That could be the Ten of Cups that I'm seeing. Could be coming towards you that's going to be very stable and secure for you. Something very solid. And I think with that Queen of Pentacles energy, that's where you are. You're not actively seeking anything out um, because you're not going to entertain nonsense. Okay, if it's not the real thing, you don't want to deal with it. Point blank, plain, simple, end of story. Um, so with the king showing up here, that says to me that you could have somebody on the way that is very solid, stable partnership for you. That could be a good match, you know. There's the page of wands. So this is, um, it could be an earth sign. Did I say earth? No, I'm sorry, I meant fire. <clears throat> Be a fire sign coming towards you. Mm -hmm. It's the Knight of Pentacles. Yeah. So we got the page, we got the Knight, we got the Queen, we got the King. Very solid, stable stuff coming your way, Pisces. Okay. Yeah, I think this is definitely a relationship coming towards you. Somebody is going to offer you something very stable and solid, which you've just been kind of like sitting back and waiting for, you know? You're not out actively searching for it. If it happens, it happens. If not, I'm okay. You know, I'm over here, Nine of, Nine of Pentacles energy. But I think it's definitely coming towards you. And I think it might be with the fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay. So this is the Page of Swords. Okay. If you see, 
sorts are communication. So it could be somebody wanting to express something to you and he just doesn't know how, you know, like in the suit of swords, he would be the least experienced. He'd be like kind of this immature guy trying to figure shit out. So maybe he wants to say something to you, but he's not quite sure how to approach you or how to say it. Um, also, if you see here, he's kind of out on the lookout. He's out on the, on the mountaintop with his sword drawn. So you could have somebody that's just kind of watching you right now, kind of uh, maybe stalking you a little bit on social media, seeing what you're up to, checking you out, waiting to approach you. Like he doesn't know how to come at you. Aha, uh -huh. there you see, there's the knight. Okay, so we got the page. He's checking you out, right? He's kind of, uh, you know, looking at your Snapchat, your Instagram, your Facebook, and he's like, what is this chick all about? Or what is this dude all about? You know, and then, like I said, he's trying to figure out how to approach you. But when he does, look at this, he's coming in hell on wheels look at this the horse is charging got the sword raised when he figures out how he wants to do this there's not going to be any holding this this person back because what i'm seeing is very solid and stable here this is somebody who knows what they want but they just have to get to that point that's what i'm seeing and you know with you being you know not in any hurry this is also a good match in that in that aspect. You're both kind of on some watch and wait kind of energy. Tower. Okay, I don't know what that's all about. Something's gonna break down. Um, something unexpected you didn't see coming. That could be anything. I, I don't know what to tell you on that. But look, after the tower moment, look. I don't know if maybe you guys are gonna have a miscommunication or I don't know what that tower moment is about, but look at what comes after. The six of pentacles, that's an equal partnership. That's give and take. That's an equal amount on both sides. You know, nobody is higher than the other person. You're on the same level. This is an equal, solid relationship. You got pentacles all over this, which indicates to me very solid very stable once this comes together there's not going to be a whole lot of breaking it apart let me put you that way all right let's see what the animal spirit oracle deck says for our takeaway message for this reading so you see the ten of cups there that's coming towards you just be patient you have been patient Let's see, you're all about patient right now. You're in no hurry. So we're just waiting for the, uh, you know, the person, possibly a fire sign, to figure out what they want to do. Rhino spirit, overcome any obstacle. Okay, overcome any obstacle. So I don't know, maybe that is tied in with the tower moment. Maybe you're going to have some kind of obstacle in your way. Um... I don't know. But while you're in watch and wait mode, you know, it might be a good idea to just kind of like getting obstacles out of your way. Anything that might stand in your way of this happiness and this union, you know, clear house. Get it out of the way. Do a little housekeeping. All right, Pisces, that's what I have for you for this week. I hope that made sense. I hope that resonated for you. And I will see you next time.